All right, Gil, this is from last Saturday, buddy. A um, lot of swings in this video here. Um, again, <clears throat> you know, a lot of progress. <clears throat> what I want you to think about when you do your dry swings today uh, or this week is that you're going to, to um, think about keeping your head, hips, everything down. Now here's a little clip from Steven's workout and I want you to take a look at that a couple of times, okay? A lot of similarities, what you're doing with your legs. The only thing is, is he's not bringing his hips up. He's staying down or he's not pulling himself out. It's like over, you know, he has a problem sometimes of getting uh, too much rotation in his hips and getting too hippy in his swing. Um, so what he was working on was thinking about staying behind the ball uh, as much as possible. So I want you to think about this. Try to when you stay back like this and you get your hands moving forward, keep your hands in. Everything goes straight to the ball, and you're not. Um, your, your hands are going to the ball and through the ball, not to the ball and then back towards third base dugout, okay? That's a real long swing right there, buddy. That's not good. Gets better towards the end. Front shoulders going right to the ball. You stay down. Okay, letting your arms get a little bit long on these swings. Let the ball come to you. Now you can go back into the videos and you can look at anybody you want to when they, you know, with uh, um, within the this this channel. So I want you to go and look at various guys what they're doing. Okay, and I want you to work on keeping your hands close. Okay. Not raising up. I mean, that's a continual song that we keep singing. Now, next after this, we're going to start. I'm going to show you some of the throws, and you can compare and look how wide your finish is. Okay, and look at the difference. See how far your knees are apart from one another. Okay, here's my my throw. You can just see a difference. You know, your your chest was up, and then your follow through, your legs were really far apart. And I come directly over into uh, towards the direction I'm throwing. <clears throat> you know, you kind of step to the side, follow through. I want your momentum. I would want I would want my momentum going to the bag, wherever I'm throwing the ball. This is to the plate keep my head above my knee everything's moving forward now see my palm is back I'm pushing the ball back my fingers on top of it and follow through towards the target <clears throat> keep my momentum going okay your palm is up little things like this um, you know you just need to work on it go back and look at this this tape several times and um, We'll work on this again one, one day next week. See you, see you Saturday.